A man is dead after his home caught fire this morning in Dearborn. CBS News Detroit's Alicia Bergio spoke with neighbors and the fire chief to learn more about the situation surrounding the tragedy. It was around 7.30 this morning when a call came in of smoke billowing out of this home off Detroit Street in Dearborn. A fire that left one man dead and firefighters recovering after a life-threatening situation. You guys running them out the window? There was just smoke like everywhere. I like ran out of the house. I could see the smoke pouring out from here, like everywhere. Riley Hebert says within minutes, first responders arrived on scene Monday to save her next door neighbor. Very, very quick. There was like one, then two, then three, and then four. Like there's like one after another. Like they were on top of it very fast. Heavy flames and smoke engulfed the home. Dearborn Fire Chief Joseph Murray saying when they pulled up, neighbors were knocking on doors and windows to rescue the man inside. It was when firefighters entered the home the situation turned dangerous. The house had some hoarder conditions in it, make complicating the, the rescue. This prompted a call for more backup. And as the smoke continued at a rapid pace, Chief Murray says it was then firefighters called a mayday. Two firefighters ran out of air. One was able to self extricate and get himself out of the window. The other was assisted with a rapid intervention team, uh, but was also able to extricate uh, himself out of the, um, the building. So there were no serious injuries. Crews were able to get the elderly man quickly out of the home, where he later died at a nearby hospital. The cause of the fire, still under investigation. God bless his family, too, though. That is super, super sad. The chief says when crews arrived on scene, there were no active smoke alarms, and they are still looking into if any were working in the home. In Dearborn, Alicia Bergio, CBS News, Detroit.